Hello, welcome to the Bart Splash race management software. In this video, we're quickly going to run through how to create a race and how to manage the entries into that race. Um, so log into your club page. If you've forgotten your password, if you email team at bartsplash.com, then we'll be able to reallocate your password. When you get in, this is your page you'll see for the club. Um, this is Goring Thameside Club. They have quite a few entries. They've only got 20% complete, so it's a good opportunity to update your Facebook, put some photos, that sort of thing on your profile page. At the top here, you've got a race management button. If you click that, it takes you to the race management site, and you've got a couple of different things here. Now, just to know, if you're running a combined race, there's more than one club you're going to want to put in results for. Email team at bartsplash.com and we'll get it set up so you can access the results. So to get things started, we're going to create a race. So follow this across, click the big blue button. Comes through onto here. So now it's going terms, let's put it. Click going terms, Arts Bash 2015. Okay, put the date in, put the start time in, put the race format. Now you've only got Bart's Bash, which is your normal, normal race, or the Bart's Boy Race, which is your time trial out and back. Put down the wind strength, let's put 7 to 12 knots. You can put a description if you want. And then click save changes. So there you go, this is your main results page. It's got your race up, it's got the date, it's got the time, it's got the wind strength, and it's got the number of boats and the number of sailors. Now, down the bottom here, sailors. If we click sailor list, this is going to give us a chance to see who's entered the race. Gives you all the names, gives you the boat details, the sail number if they put it in, the name of the vessel, the boat class, their role, their age, and their experience. On the left here, you've got email. So you can click that, you can email the individuals, and you can send them out to say instructions, notice the race. So if you want to use this as a sign on, come to the top right, you've got download sailors. Click that button and it'll download an Excel CSV file. Now you can use this as the, as the starting point. I'm just going to expand it there. So we've got, for instance, first line we've got Neil, it's a skipper, uh, boat class is a laser, sound number 83585. It's got its age category experience and it's got um, home club as well. So you can use this as your sign up sheet. If people want to enter additionally, you know, if I wanted to enter in my RS400, then you can just put them in. You can always use it as a sign on, sign off sheet. You could, oh, where are we going? You could, at the top here, you could have distance and elapsed time, and that way you can get pretty much all the results on this one sheet. So you can download that, print it off, and use it at your club. So I'm not going to say that. So there we go. We've got, and you can click on race management to go back. So we know which sailors we've got. We've created a race. And now we're going to go on to the next video, which will be how to input your results.